Okay, welcome back to Seven Days to Die, Sorcery Point Eight O Six. This is Alchemy Update, and it is my blood, my eighth Blood Moon of this season. It is on day forty-three. My Blood Moons are random; they are anywhere between uh, three to ten days apart. And this one was actually eight days after the last one, which surprised me, because that's one of the... No, that's not just one of the. That is the longest it's gone without giving me a blood moon. Uh, my first three blood moons were 3, 7, and 14. So, by day 14, I had already had three blood moons. But, this is going to be blood moon 43. And, yeah, I gotta remember to turn that alarm back off before I come back so that you guys don't get annoyed by having to hear it. Okay, anyway, as I was saying, Blood Moon uh, 43, thinking about doing some base work, but the fact of the matter is, aside from some basic repairs, which I should probably do before Horde Night, my base is actually n not needing much work at the moment because I don't have the components I want. Namely, I still don't have... A motion sensor! Oh, I never made that corner piece? Okay, apparently I need to make that corner piece still. Okay, I got the con... That's not a big deal. Well... It won't be ready uh, anytime soon because it's, <laughs> the, it's kind of busy with something else right now, but uh, it is a full corner, this is what the piece is called, there it is. Okay, after the <laughs> cement, I mean the sand is done, my full corner will pop out of there. Maze works fine without that corner, corner would just be an upgrade to it. Ooh, look at that. They actually took out a piece. Well, if they manage to take out a piece, it gets replaced. Uh... We'll go ahead and put pieces back in there. Okay, that piece is about to go. You know what? Since these pieces are about to go, let me just... Uh, those pieces weren't about to go, but they are now. That one was. Okay, what movement was that? Was that an animal? I think it was. A, I think it was a damn rabbit again. I saw movement out of the corner of my eye over there. Don't know what it was. Of course, I could just be seeing things again. since it's already... Oops. Well, one of them's already upgraded to steel. That's unfortunate because it's still early enough game that I don't have a lot of steel to be wasting. Okay, hold back of the maze is reinforced. Mm, 
The main base ain't going anywhere because it's got all these extra walls now. Oh, I forgot to bring it and pull out the... Oh, that's a... That was a stupid mistake. Okay, give me a second. I got stuck on that door now. What? Oh. I would somehow land right in the one hole that's out here. I got seven ice, uh, seven, or, or ice fives out of that. Four thirty AM. And that rabbit's still running around out there. There he is. I've actually seen the rabbit come up and go through, like, halfway through my maze before. Like, what the hell are you doing on my maze? Uh, I want to play with a screamer, but you should never play with a screamer just before Horde Night. In case the screamer breaks something, and then you're screwed for Horde Night. Little bunnies still running around out there. I'm far from the need of me, right? Yeah, I got over 500 meat. I'm not even using it. Same with the red tea, I got a lot of it. I'm not even using it. See, Ravage, he, he just went into my maze. The rabbit is walking the maze.
and he doesn't the rabbit doesn't have a slow animation so that's why it's doing his standing anim animation because he's slowed by the barbed wire and there he's unslowed and oh, he's slowed by the barbed wire again where are you going buddy and he's gonna walk into the barbed wire there he is screaming as he's trying to jump over the barbed wire now. He's gonna break my barbed wire. Oh, never mind. Dead wabbit! <sighs> well, since you insisted on delivering m your meat for consumption, I will harvest you. Even let him intentionally let him live because I didn't need to meet. And what's he do? He runs in and suicides. Crazy wabbit. Huh, oh, I thought I heard something. Probably hearing things again. Yeah, the problem is I gotta do something about this opening here, too. Because this is wide open. If I could stand in here, if a cop happens to spawn over there, I'll get hit in the back of the head by his vomit. In a multiplayer game, I put a little cage on this area here specifically so that there was something here to stop things spotting over there from seeing or from being able to hit me Uh, it doesn't look that great, but I'm going to go ahead and throw up what I threw on my multiplayer base just so I have something there to stop from being hit in the head back of the head by a... That's what I did in my multiplayer. And now, if I'm standing over here, uh, if the spider, if a cop's close enough to spit, it's basically blocked by those bars there. Oh, I see what you're saying. You're talking, you're saying, uh,. You're saying uh, you I should do something like like put it right over here like that. That's what you're saying, huh? Yeah, that'll work for now. But the problem is, uh, I put dart traps right there, and I attached the uh, trip wire to the front of the dart trap, which I can't do with the bar with the with those bars there. But that comes after I remodel. For this will more than suffice until I until the remodeling. It also serves another purpose. It'll keep my uh, 
keep stuff safe over there too. But okay, and we are about to start Blood Moon Forty Three, the eighth Blood Moon of this series. And this time we are going to have some fun with spells. We're going to throw a bunch of ice spells, maybe some ice storms, some ice spikes, fire nados. These are all spells that I found. I do not have them leveled up. I focus on lightning and lightning nova first. So those are the ones that are, lo that are leveled up. But we're going to have some fun with the spells, the extra spells I just found in looting. I think we're going to start off with Ice Spike, because those can be fun. Of course it's not leveled up, which means I'm not it's not going to have a high chance of dismemberment, but it can dismember. Of course you have to hit your target for it to dismember anything, but that's beside the point, right? Start breaking shit, and I'll start casting uh, lightning novas. I'll start casting his own breaking shit, man. Oh, you guys are beating on each other. Uh, that's acceptable. That's acceptable. You're all running around with ice spikes. In your Here, let me give me give me that back. Thank you. Can I have mine back? Is that back? Yes. Thank you. Hit her with an ice storm before we switch over to some ice storm. She's probably regenerated. I should probably focus her down before she gets too far. I can get my spells back from her. Oh, I can get my spell back from you. Thanks, buddy. Oh, there he is. Okay.
love it when they decide they want to go into destroy mode while they're halfway through the maze. When instead of just dropping off the maze to go into destroy mode, they decide to run back along the maze. And then halfway back along the maze, they're like, nope, I'm going to go back into uh, get to him mode and then turn around and run back the other direction. Never actually getting anywhere. This guy, is, uh, that guy actually ran back and forth two different times. No shortcutting the maze, little shit. All this is for just from spells I found. I haven't used any of the ones I made yet. We're almost done with the Horde Knight. <laughs> okay, we got a radiated cop out there. Fire spell off on him while he was uh, 
on, on, uh, with the, uh, Fire Nato. No, what the? Really? Really? Lot of damage if you can hit him with a uh, 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 put some points on him afterwards. Well, that glass was bound to go. I was waiting for it to go. It lasted longer than I expected it to, actually. It's kind of sad to come hit the glass while shooting at me while you're standing, uh, what, what about five meters from me? Six meters from me? of the ones I found. I might actually have to plot some spells I made. Down to 79. Hey, I did still have something else left. I could hit him with this. He was that too. Oh, I missed. Missed the guy in front, but how did that not hit the cop? Die before you explode. Do not explode. Do not explode. You're gonna explode. Die. Why is he not dying? And he exploded. Damn it. Okay, okay, I was trying not to use my spells, but I hear you, and that is unacceptable.
back in. Wow. That was a complete miss on my part. Oh, it's another radiated cop. Wow, I just missed him twice, that's sad. Okay, we still got some more fire spells to play with. Okay, stop beating on each other. call that a successful Horde Knight, especially since I kept uh, using the min using usage of my spells to a minimum and focused on using the spells that I had for gotten for free. And granted, he did those explody cops did some damage to my maze, but nothing too bad. Mostly, mostly just took out a bunch of my barbed wire, old bastards. Yeah. Normally you can kill the cops before they explode without issue. The only problem was I was using my unupgraded spells, so naturally they weren't doing as much damage as uh, they uh, could have been. But we did successfully use up... All, well, I did actually successfully use up all of the spells, but I was able to fix some of them back up. Steel Fire Axe f 6, huh? Okay. Well, looks like we gotta, we're gonna be selling our... Our 4 now. Bunker Buster Schematic, that'll come in handy. Oh wait, I already have one, never mind. Won't come in handy. Okay. Yeah, that was actually a very. Oh, nope, that doesn't go in there. That goes right there. Again. There we go. And on that note. Actually, let's look to see how much damage they did first. I was going to say, I was going to call it, but I can't resist looking to see the damage. Yeah, all my windows are gone now from that cop. <laughs> uh, minimal damage to the spell, to the conjurer, so I'm not worried about it. i fix those for now. Eventually those will go bye-bye anyway, but... I'm not worried if that goes. If that goes, I'll replace it with the window that goes there because I do have already have the bulletproof window made that goes there. So not too bad on the damage there. Uh, yeah, some of the damage over here. That's from the cops spitting at the at the maze. Okay, we did have something beating on something down here. But all the damage down here is minimal as well. So, yeah, I would go so far to say that that was a pretty much flawless Blood Moon. I mean, 
minimal damage everywhere. The only thing I, the only thing, the only damage that I really got was I lost a bunch of my barbed wire. And of course these bars here, because they're made out of wood, doesn't take much. But, whoops, I did not mean to repair that one, but yeah. I would definitely call that a successful, very, almost fl practically flawless Blood Moon. But on that note, it is time for me to get some sleep for work tomorrow. And so, hope you enjoyed the video, the stream, the Blood Moon 40... What was that? Blood Moon 43? Yes, it was Blood Moon 43. And so, until next time, have a great one. I hope to see you around.